It's the Joe Padula Show, Clarksville's conversation. Absolutely. What is the uh, biggest phobia for Tennesseans? And in Tennessee, where is the where in Tennessee is the pet monkey biting women? I mean, where in the state, not not where on the woman? All right. Okay. That's all now on the Joe Padula Show. Absolutely. Don't forget to subscribe, share, and definitely comment. Woo. Phobias. Bay, I, what, what are you afraid of? You got a phobia? Phobia? Yeah. Anything that you fear? What do you fear? <laughs> what, spiders? What is it? Not having it yet. Not, okay. <laughs> Bo has a phobia of unemployment. That's, uh, that's true. Uh, what do you think uh, Tennesseans are most afraid of? Snakes. Snakes. Yeah? Okay. I'm going to say that because most of everybody I know are afraid of snakes. I'm terrified of spiders, but I can understand if they're, if everyone's afraid of snakes. Lawyer Wayne, what do you think? Hmm, snakes is a good one. A phobia, to me, means an irrational fear. So you wouldn't say like bears, because you should be afraid of bears. Okay. <laughs> and bears are strong. Mm-hmm. Makes sense. Can kill you. Mm-hmm. Mice. Oh. Have, always, have always been interesting to me. Uh, there, there are people, oh, yeah. uh, mostly women oh, yeah. that I've known. Yeah, I know uh, a couple of dudes. Who, <laughs> and I'm sure, I'm sure, I'm sure some guys too, that that have a, a real fear of, of mice. They'll see one, they'll scream or, or, or jump or run. Yeah. Um, <laughs> and it'd be very difficult for a mouse to even harm you, let alone kill you. They're not like bears. And they're not like rats or either. snakes. There's a or difference. Rats. Right. rats Mm. You know, rats are like giant mice. I get that. Oh know. man, did you ever see a New York rat? <laughs> I have not. Oh my god, they look like they look like possums with 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 darker well, skin. Rats are bad guys in Disney movies and stuff too, mm-hmm. right? Rats are, are sinister. They have you know they they have you know bi- bad connotations from childhood. Mice, they're they're, they're, they're heroes. Well, they're Cinderella. They're rats of dim. Mickey they're, Mouse for crying out loud. I guess uh, yeah. Radigan from um, yeah. Great Mouse Detective. Sure, Ratatouille. Ratatouille. Yeah, there's some, you can think of some good examples of rats. Jerry. No, no scary mice, though, is my point. I don't know where this fear of mice comes from. Eddie, what do you think? Tennessee's top phobia. I guess I would have to say spiders. Oh, yeah. Do you have a fear of spiders? I don't. Now, what's a phobia you have? I don't really think I have a phobia. Good answer. Good answer. We'll find out, though. I got a whole list. Maybe you fall under one All of them. All right, maybe. What do you say, Mikey? Yeah, spiders. Yeah. yeah. Fine. Happened spiders. to me this morning. Yeah, are you afraid of spiders? Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. Do you touch them? Like, damn camel spider coming at me. Oh like that. yeah. And then to this morning, we're uh-huh. on the garage door, and I have a pitchfork, and my wife's like, "Oh, you get it? I'm like, no, you get it? It's got to burn the house down. We're good. It's got a pitchfork for that spider." Yeah. And intern Shane, you said uh, spiders as well. Okay. I hate spiders. Tennessee's top phobia is blood. Hmm. Blood. Yeah. Yeah. It's blood. Who's really? taking these? The people that are, there are people that will pass out at the sight of blood, even their own blood. According to the study, called? Uh, arachnophobia made up uh, 22% of all phobias, okay, for the U.S. What would blood phobia be? Sang- sanguinophobia? But uh, the, uh, and it's interesting because that arachnophobia increased from, uh, from last year. But, uh, yeah, the, uh, it's interesting. That blood is Tennessee, their top phobia. Hemophobia, that's the fear of blood. There you go. I don't think they like being called that. <laughs> <laughs> Remember that movie, Arachnophobia? Though? Yeah. <laughs> oh, God, that, that movie awakened my fear of spiders. <laughs> that awakened my arachnophobia. I don't have I don't have cereal boxes for a reason. I have the clear containers. Mm-hmm. From that spider was inside this. No, bro. No, no. I couldn't touch a cereal box for months after I first saw that movie. Mm-hmm. Fear of germs is a big one now. That's, oh, that's what a uh, monk had, especially this year. Yeah, like I ne- yeah exactly. I've never really had a germophobia until. Oh. I, I I don't have one now, but I have a more of a. Phobia of I, it. I'm sure there will be some people who who have lingering germophobia after this uh, pandemic. Most a lot likely. more hand washing, compulsive sanitizers. When I was younger, we weren't so sheltered. 
everybody's sheltered now. Nobody can mm. be in a mud puddle because they're right. Gonna catch, yeah. yeah, go get dirty. Now everybody's soft and <laughs> <laughs> wearing skinny jeans. Yeah, I think that's weird. <laughs> I tried the skinny jeans once. I don't like it. I never have. No, I'm good. I was walking like I was Frankenstein. I couldn't bend the legs. It's hard to find a pair of sweatpants nowadays. Can't even find them. I look like half empty. Uh, toothpaste and skinny jeans just <laughs> <laughs> I'm pouring you know out the, the top of it it's interesting the top fear in New York what is it interesting intimacy <laughs> it's a tough phobia really yeah I'm afraid of intimacy hmm flying's a big one still California fear of social media <laughs> what <laughs> there's a lot of actors over there though so yeah That's you know what I'm saying heights <laughs> a lot of a lot of actors and a lot of political activists up there too. This is a shame. In North Dakota, they got a the top phobia is fear of holes. <laughs> <laughs> and yes, clowns is still a fear, huh? That's another I, one. Yeah, you don't like clowns? I, I grew up around the circus. I'm not even joking. Yeah, what do you mean you grew up around circus? My grandparents were uh here, into the microphone. Uh, my grandparents were uh, promoters for the Shrine Circus out of Milwaukee, Wisconsin, the George Carden Circus. Wow. So I, I showed a lot of elephant. Yeah? Duke. Yeah. And it just, well, every time I wanted to go stay with my grandparents, I was like, yeah, had circus. I mean, clowns everywhere up on the wall and stuff. <laughs> In a dark room, you see just this body standing <laughs> up here. They changed the whole room around when I was a kid. And even now, I don't like them. Crazy You clowns. remember back in 2016, that whole clown craze where everybody was dressing as clowns and stalking people outside the house or walking around in fields chasing people who well, came by? Wasn't it uh, re-released at that time, right? Uh, uh, it was the reboot. The reboot, yeah. I know that. It was the, the, reboot. Uh, the reboot of the first It movie, or think, chapter one, I should say. I think pe- one of the reasons people don't, don't like clowns and find them creepy is because one of the things that people don't like are when people look weird. Because when you see a person, right, and they look wrong, you know, the, the wrong color, the, the, you know, their, their face is misshapen or something like that, that means only one of a few things, you know, you know it might be a single disease, you know, if this person, you know, has spots all over them or something, you stay away from them, or they might be dead if it's a corpse, that's also bad. And clowns, with their makeup, their exaggerated features and stuff, they, they come across as a caricature of human, uh, of human appearance, and it puts people off a lot. It's the Joe Padula Show. Bada bing. Clarksville's conversation.